Next on the agenda is the summer program. Bare young people have been asking me what we're doing since lockdown has been eased. Why don't we open up the youth club and do loads of activities? But we can't have that many people. So Jordan, what is the maximum number of people we can have at AYP with social distancing? 15 including youth workers, so that means 10 young people. What if we do it outside? What? Like we get all the activities, computer rooms, sports, gaming, the stuff we use to do inside, let's do it outside. Can we do tutoring for all of the stuff that we missed at school? Then if lockdown happens again, we can deliver everything virtually. We can also do workshops like first aid and uh, conflict resolution. Yeah, that would be good. Bugsy not doing any risk assessments. I'll do that if you do the project plan. Hi, my name's Jordan. I'm one of the junior program coordinators and I basically run this place. And I came up with a summer program. Anyway, this is our food bank. And this is our office. The summer program will be made up of virtual activities just outside. We will have tutoring, gaming, cooking classes, workshops including mental health awareness, first aid, employability and sports. We already do most of these online and use the same timetable, five days a week for six weeks. Many young people don't have computers making it difficult to join and have been breaking lockdown as they are bored. Our activities have been chosen by the young people for the young people via our weekly course. Hello, this is Fatima from Ansar Youth Project. How are you today? The workshops will be linked to qualifications and employability. It will be completely run by young people. The three outcomes from this project will be develops young people's skills and employability. Not only will our skills improve, but the young people who attend will learn soft skills and gain qualifications, making them more employable. Diversionary activity. Young people will be able to have fun without putting themselves and others at risk. Improve health. Sports and healthy cooking classes will increase physical health. Mental health awareness workshops will increase mental health. Young people being able to meet their friends, other young people and being able to speak to youth workers will improve their emotional health.